Okay, all right, we have Natalie with us today. So tell me a little bit about why you decided to um, start a virtual bookkeeping business. Sure, uh, well, I separated from the military exactly a year ago today. Wow, that's, <laughs> awesome. yeah. And so I got my master's in marriage and family therapy and I jumped right into my career. Um, but I was commuting a good two hours um, to go to work. So it wasn't a big deal until I got pregnant. So I got pregnant. Now I have a three month old, a nine year old and a seven year old. Um, so it put everything kind of back, you know, seven years back into perspective. And I realized I wanted to be home with my child and not pay daycare again. Um, but I still wanted to practice. So I went on maternity leave. And during that time, my husband decided to retire. So because we don't have an obligation to stay here where we're at now, um, we decided we're going to move after the school year. But that means for my trade, I shouldn't and I'm not going to get back into practicing because it's just not good client care because um, we're going to leave in May. So that kind of put me in a kind of a damper as far as income goes. Yeah. Um, and then I came across your advertisement on Facebook and, you know, you never know if they're scams. So of course mm -hmm. I like researched it, researched your name and everything. Um, it seemed almost too good to be true. And then I was like, well, let me just get the book and see what happens. And just one step after the other, and then the discounted course and here I am. Awesome. So I don't remember exactly what day I purchased. You could probably look at your invoices and see, but that purchase happened. And then I kind of sat on it for a couple of days just because life happens. Mm -hmm. And then that next Thursday or whatever, I brought everything together. And then I had a client that following Monday. Wow. That's awesome. That's so <laughs> great. <laughs> Congratulations. So Thanks. what do you, what do you think about the course in general? And what do you think was the biggest reason why you got a client so fast? Uh, the course in general was really user friendly. At first, I thought when I plugged in, I was going to plug in with a bunch of students who have already been, you know, like ahead of me. Uh, but it's just self paced. I like that the videos are um, easy to understand. Yeah, you know, I was afraid because you, you're a CPA and I have no background in financing or accounting mm -hmm. that you were going to use lingo that I'd have to get some kind of finance dictionary for or something <laughs> so I like that it was just it was easy to follow um I liked your cannabis background but should I say that I'm like <laughs> so I was like okay well this is interesting and um you know as I started to go to these websites that you're recommending they worked you know it wasn't just this this scam that I bought into and um you know, these things don't actually work when you buy them, you know, mm -hmm. um, but it worked. And so little by little, I built a business, I guess you can say, and then um, advertised it on Facebook. And that's the only avenue. I think you had like three or four recommendations of getting clients. Mm -hmm. That was the only avenue I attempted because I could afford at the time. And I didn't think anything of it uh, other than let me just get my name out there, you know, right. and people I know can know what I'm doing. Um, and my client, I guess you could say, uh, jumped in my DMs, <laughs> uh, because I had friended, you know, I just friended a bunch of people that had the same, uh, interests yeah. and, uh, as far as financing and things like that. Uh, but he is a business owner and seven figures easy just in the part the partnerships he makes or, and, uh, he was just like, Hey, you know, what are you selling? And I'm like, Oh. <laughs> well, I'm not really selling. I'm offering services, you know, and he's like, well, hold on. Are you a therapist or are you a bookkeeper? And I'm like, well, kind of both. And he's like, great, I'm looking for both. And that's kind of how we started talking. And I'm like, nice. well, <laughs> we can decide what we want to do because I can't do both. And um, he told me what he, you know, what he's concerned about as far as his books go. And yeah. We met, which was another kind of milestone where I sort of doubted myself, like, this person's not real, you know, <laughs> this can't yeah. be real, uh, but he's very real, and, you know, we have a, a thing going now, and so I took your advice as far as the don't go lower than 75 an mm -hmm. hour, um, so that's what I proposed it at, but since we sat down and looked at the books, it goes all the way back to 2016, okay. so I'm working on trying to present some kind of package Okay. Um, together if we're going to make this a long-term thing. 
Awesome. Yeah, that's perfect. It sounds like you've really followed every step just perfectly, building relationships and connecting with people and, you know, building rapport and becoming, you know, friends with them. That's, that's what mm -hmm. people really want in a bookkeeper, somebody that they can trust and rely on and have a good relationship with. Yeah. So, yeah. That is awesome. So, so far, just one client, but, um, you know, I, I have more confidence than I did, you know, prior to the purchase, just in what I'm capable of. So, and yeah. I think that's what the biggest thing the course provided, um, you know, from Genesis to where I am now. Yeah. Awesome. That is so great. Mm -hmm. Such great news. Well, thank you for sharing that information with me. Yes, absolutely.